Excuse me. You mean the village? When I was eating... Uh, uh, anything... Uh... The scholars that have gone... <gasps> don't change this. Right, but honestly... Do you also think... Grandpa... <laughs> it still feels... Well, what I've got ya. Last time I... <sighs> oh, thick? <laughs> I... Yeah. Ooh, that... I've known you since you... Wow, what? Okay. Thank you. Uh-huh. Don't say anything. <sighs> Let's head over there. Yes, of course I have. The Scarlet King is the one and only tr still. Haven't you noticed? Delavar was saying that many people... Isn't it a sign? Huh. No. Exactly. Now, repeat everything you've just said. F huh? H who are My patience is running thin. You heard what I asked. This guy's something else. Let's not get him. Oh, okay, good sir. W what is it you would like to know? Tell me about the Scarlet King's resurrect. Well, I... I don't... <sighs> hey. It's true. It's all true, sir. We desert folk have had more than enough of those people at the Academia. They keep sending it. Would you want to live like this? If Delavar also... Is that... Uh, see... Uh, Please, don't beat me up just for mentioning these rumors. I if The people here really like the Scarlet King, but dislike the Dendro Archon. Where is this radical person you talked about? I haven't run into him over the past few days, so he probably hasn't been around the village. What about you, man? Have you seen him at all? No, uh, not at all. We wouldn't dare lie to you. He's really not here right now. Sounds like you're not... Uh, no, uh... I have many... So you'd best just don't do anything. Yes, yes. <gasps> that scared Paimon half to death. Sino is pretty terrified. Hmm. He didn't try to reassure us. I heard that. It's part of being a match. The rumor we heard just now seems like a strong lead. But we need to very well. Isaac! Uh, I am here. Where's your grandpa's house? Well, I can take you there. Grandpa? Oh, 
he likes to be alone. Uh, sometimes he stares at the sky in a daze, and other times he just pokes at the ground with his fingers. Every now and then, he yells out at the top of his lungs, so a lot of people are really scared of him. But he's a good person, really. I know he is. I swear, he, he's just like my real grandpa. There sure isn't much here. No. Incense? Uh, please don't sick, but are you okay? Are you getting dizzy or need to... There's a scent that you can sense, but I can't. A certain traveler here once passed out from that smell. Thankfully, Tainari... So, you know Tainari. Huh? You know him too? Are you two friends? Yes. Hmm. Now that I concentrate, I can also make up the scent of incense. Wait. No. No need. Did you first encounter this scent at Tainari's house? In the forest, from a scholar. Here it is. Take a look right here. Uh... Although the traces have been completely buried in the sand from the size and shape, they belong to an adult male. The scent is quite faint, but still extant. But who would come looking? We'd have to ask whoever lured him away with the incense. Exactly. Even deep within the club. No. So someone's taking advantage of their weakness? Huh. Still, why would anyone want to abduct all the scholars? Are the rumors really true? Could the disappearance of all the mad scholars have... It's highly likely. Please, you have to save my grandpa. Sounds like we'd better... Let's head to our...
darker fabric definitely looks a lot better. That'd be my choice, too. We're back, Candace! We've got a lot to tell you! Ah, welcome back. <laughs> oh, Dia's here, too! You bet. So, everything goes smoothly? Reasonably. Hmm? I'll hate- We haven't seen him- Huh. I s Did you find out anything- I see. The resurrection of the Scarlet King? First I've heard of it. Far as I know, the kind of incense you just mentioned is only popular beyond the wall. Scholars are fond of it, not to mention making- It seems someone from beyond the wall must have been supporting this. Makes sense. Hmm. So if it was any up, didn't you say that the villager got- If Paimon remembers correct- Ah, yeah. Delavar, the Scar Riddle- These guys have one thing in common, and that's being broke. The rougher life gets, the more they want to believe in the Scarlet King. The way they see it, the Scarlet King's resur- Throwing all of Sumeru into chaos is the only way to change the way of- Tia! You're amazing! You really know this place inside and out! <laughs> no Merc can afford to slack off on gathering intelligence. Every more I've- Let's head out. Now hold on- <laughs> Aru Village is not a big place. Outsiders stand out here like a sore thumb. The desert is un- t Compared to you, mercs like me are just third-rate amateurs. I've got no actual fighting skills to speak of. I need to go around- <sighs> Good, then we've got a plan. The Traveler and Paimon will go to Caravan Rebot with me, and we'll try our best to figure out where the Mad Scholars have been- All right! Sounds like you're starting to get familiar with the area. Paimon's amazed every time we see the wall of- I know what you mean. I had the same question every time. Also, why is this high wall here? And can a wall really block sandstorms? It was only after I grew up that I realized the wall of Samiel isn't just there to keep out the sandstorms. It serves a more important purpose. Sumeru is run by wa- We're cheap labor. Even if a child from the desert got the chance to obtain an Akasha terminal, almost all their requests for knowledge would be denied. The academia believes geniuses like Sat- That's terrible! I would tear down this wall with my own hands if I could. No, besides, we're here to procure information, aren't we? Yep, we gotta catch those- Shh, Caravan Rebot is crawling with people, so be careful what you say. Our mission started the moment we arrived here. Let's go check out the tavern. Just our luck. None of them are here today. You mean, you don't- Dia, is that you? <laughs> what a coincidence. Hmm? Oh, and who do you have with you here? Guests from another land? Hello, hello. 
I'm Zaki. Diaz, uh... <laughs> We've had drinks together a few times. You could say we go back a ways. Anyway... Absolutely. <laughs> Much better than those people on the other side of the wall. So... Yeah. Have you seen Enger, Delavar, or Jabari recently? Of course I have. I've got a... Ah. Hey, keep it down. Let's just say I prefer to keep this... <laughs> yes, how considerate of you. What? So he's not at the hotel today? there yet yep this place is practically deserted what are they doing in a place like this <laughs> why don't you take a guess go on uh. oh, no! it's an <sighs> what's this all about Zaki Come on, Dia. You really think we didn't hear about what you said back in Aru village? The boys have kept a close eye on you from the moment you set foot there. Not only do I know that you're looking for Delavar, I also know that you've teamed up with people from the Academia to look for the missing scholars. So, you've been watching us from the very beginning? You left the strongest one in the... So you and Della... <laughs> Dia! But you got one thing. If that's the case... I'll be honest with you. If it weren't for what you said in the village, your little monologue about the wall... Delavar. And Enger. You're here too, huh? Long time no see, Miss Mercenary. You should have known the traitors are what us... Dia. I thought that you, a fellow desert dweller would understand that the Scarlet King is greater than the Dendro Archon. Little did I know, you don't deserve to- <laughs> Yeah. See? There you have it. Mercenaries are just a bunch of- You're not wrong. Mercenaries are- Enough talking! Get him! <laughs> just as I expected. Let's teach him a lesson, Traveler. Following orders. A new punching. <laughs> Useless. Take flight! Yeah. Go for a swirl! My apologies! Impossible! How could you? So, what do you think about your meticulous network now, Zaki? How did you say it? It's only natural for a traveling mercenary like me to be out of the loop. I'm guessing your informant told you that I'm just... And of course, you would believe everything he... Re even though you heard that so-called fl... That's what you thought, right? Ugh. You lied in the village because you figured that... And you were stupid enough to fall for it. I figured as much the first time we drank together. You all thought you were so smart. Okay, that should be all of them. Whoa! So you've been planning this since we were in Aru Village? No task can be done without preparation. I just happened to notice a couple... Oh, but instead of catching them right away, you... Those two who were snooping around were just a couple small fries. If we want to get the real catch, we have to be patient and give it some time. You mean the funny name she 
you mentioned back in Uncle Ampu's house? The wide-eyed butcher, Scarborough old bandit, uh, um, uh, Paimon can't remember. That. That's just a bunch of drunk talk. Enger and Delavar alcohol has... What about Zaki? He's just a numbskull who fell right into our trap. Zaki was probably the best hidden of them all. My initial plan was... That's what you wanted to... Wait, so he's a radical too? No, he isn't. I just needed to tack on a random villager name to make the eavesdropper think that I was making some wild guesses based on my impressions. Wow, what a genius idea! Ah, uh, you're too... So... Hmm? Ba about how mercy Does that bother you? What makes you so sure? Uh... Dia? Do you did... <laughs> you two are pretty sharp. No. I don't have anything against the Dendro Archon. I've heard a lot of night. Dunyarzad's just an ordinary person. I've begun to reel, but I see through it. Dia. Anyway, look. <laughs> this should be all of them. I'll let you take it from here. All right. I'll be in touch. Until then, please stand by. Candace, do you need any help? Candace will be okay on her own. I trust her, so you can too. She's been guarding Aru Village for quite some time now. If anyone is qualified to question the offenders, it's her. While I'm questioning them. I'll meet you back here tomorrow morning, Traveler. As for these idiot, time <laughs> Paimon's been more we've known each other for s oh Paimon yep I guess us mercs on the other well Paimon thinks really oh Zyno yes I was here yesterday to help out a little to help out by doing what sharing some oh um you mean you talked right come on in everyone Come on, let's go inside. There's no mask that can hide true bloodlust. Cover up your eyes, and it'll still show itself at the corner. Perhaps I need to... Still... Uh, yes, please. Well, looks like Sino taught her well. <laughs> you fear death yourself. The ones you call mad scholars are known to us as the village keepers. They are vital members of our community. You come here to my village. Uh, mercy! Please have mercy! You've made your bed. We may both be desert dwellers, 
But there is one thing that I and the people of Aruv, a war would only- uh, we understand. I'll tell you everything I know. I'm listening. Uh, some mystery man told- They're called village keepers. Slip up again and you'll regret it. Uh, yes, it was all that mystery man's doing. He told us to spread word about the Scarlet King's resurrection and talked us into helping him. In return, he said he'll help facilitate the resurrection process. I'm... That's one. Huh? Strike. You gotta... Wait, I'm telling... <sighs> he got us to lure them... <sighs> you gotta believe me, please. That was indeed the truth. Traveler. Go on. You have to believe me. He, um, that... I believe I may know what's going... Uncle Anpu? <laughs> Okay. If my sus hmm. sometime it strikes me, which means it's huh. they were the ones who brought them here to begin. Not the academiac. Just as I. But what could they want? People are nothing. <sighs> Regardless. You're right. Time to go. Yes. You got it. All right. Let's meet back here. surprised that you decided it's all Haytham. You haven't helped us out at all ever since we arrived at Aru Village. Bold of you to question our choices. Yeah, you're all talk. While you were investig- Really? To be honest, not to mention that- Huh? Right. Correct. What did you learn? I'm going to take you- What is that? How do you think the residents of Aru Village feel about what we're doing? In other words, do you truly believe every single word the villagers tell us? You mean, some of them lied to us? Hiding the truth does not necessarily equate to lying. Again, these people have their reasons. Remember what Gandis said? Most people in Aru Village don't miss. By contrast, the perils of their daily lives are ever-present concerns. They won't simply share everything they know with you without good reason. That's why you believe, glad you're following, among those you have taught, the reason being, to someone who only wants to live their life in peace, any external factors introduce unpredictable. <gasps> Don't change the s- It's quite obvious that she's intimid- Right. She corrected herself mid-sentence because she's aware that there are- I think it's been a few- Remember? But honestly, I feel quite sympathetic- After speaking to the village chief, it became- and... By getting involved with an outside- I'll pass on this. You said that she- Liron! Miss Shawnee, as we discussed earlier... <laughs> Mr. Ohe... Huh? Go ahead and talk to her. Go on. Is it really that simple? Uh, uh, may I call you Traveler? Uh, hi, Traveler. Do you think the resurrection of the Scarlet King can truly change Sumeru for the better? Why is that? 
That's very similar. Before, I wouldn't even have the courage to ask something like this. Traveler, do you believe our lives will get better? Apologies for posing my... Oh, hey, them to the fact is that I'm... Only one side of my family is desert folk. Some believe in the Dendro Archon, while others believe in the Scarlet King. I don't belong to either side, and neither side would want me. Speaking of which, the radicals mentioned that they despise traitors. Do they just think that anyone who's different from them is a traitor? Yeah. Some people can be so narrow-minded when it comes to bloodline and beliefs. It makes no difference what I say or how I behave. I'll always be slowly. I just stopped talking and then it happened. You can tell them. <laughs> All right. I'll tell you. I actually... <gasps> perhaps... It used to be... I confirmed this, but... Because we're in the middle of a desert, you would rather believe that they are the cries of beasts than ghosts. There's really no- I think they used to use it for treating Elazar, but it's been abandoned for years. Let's go in and take... Patience. Shawnee says she only hears the crying at night. We have time to burn. Until then... I'm taking a break. <sighs> and just like that, he sits down. Wait, he even brought a book to read? What are you reading? Let Pun- Okay, sure. So... Oh, Paimon gives up. You keep... 
keep reading your book. See ya! How is he so relaxed? Look at him, reading an impossible book in a creepy place like this. Hey, Paimon! And anyway, is that Paimon's fault that the books people read in Tamaru are so complicated? There it is. It's coming from that direction. Is the sound coming from here? Huh. Paimon's not seeing anything. Hmm? It's from below. Uh, but there's... Something is off about the interior here. There's a hidden structure. Wow. It's like they t Oh, it looks like there are other
approach him slowly without a lot. Wait. You're... He can't speak, and his eyes are unfocused. Also, why is he the only one here? Didn't expect to see him here. You know him? He's Razak, a senior of mine at the academy. He's a scholar, too? Is he the kind that holds up in a forest and mumbles stuff about training? No. Razak was never involved in any of those things. He never trained in the forest, let alone reach Satyavada life. Leaving that question aside for the mo- Looks like they've already taken everyone away. For whatever reason, they left Razak here. Hmm, there are drag marks on the ground. They're clearer by the doorway. Someone was forceful- Loaded with people? That is one possibility. Hmm. It looks like they were in a hurry. The symptoms are identical. Looks like- Huh? Why do you say that? Allow me to jog your memory. Recall your time at Port Ormos. Don't you think his symptoms look familiar? <laughs> Correct. The Academia is behind all- It isn't difficult to deduce the rash- First, these rumors were all the persuasion that the Radicals needed, and those based in Aru Village, as well as being able to exploit the life for the dust, many would give ev even if complications arise. The notion of an Academia- Oh, that makes a lot- But there's- Throughout this process, one- First, they were scholars. Then, they became lunatics. After that, they were exiles. And finally, they become missing persons. An exile is if you can't find resource. One possible extract with the technology of the perhaps the so the human. I'm the academia scrub. Anyway, judging by Razak's or perhaps his curious. Uh, the look on your face tells me you've realized the answer. That's right. However. The Academia, I've spent quite some- You mean, you're not even slightly in- All scholars seek to expand the horizons of knowledge. But I'm not extracting information from people as if they were lifeless objects. Sounds like you're really- Of course. The Academia's action, whether it be academics or knowledge, everything has its boundaries. If those lines are crossed, the rules and order that this matter needs to be corrected. Just like fixing a typo in a book. Wait! Not to be callous, but no there is no shortage of suffering in Sumeru. And the same can be said for the rest of Tibet. Um, probably not. Uh, Paimon? You can say that. The Divine Knowledge Capsule. Paimon's been wanting to say this for a while. There are a lot of bad guys in the academia, but... <laughs> Though I must say, uniqueness is also an asset, is it not? Wow. That's a great way to think about it. Paimon's really impressed. If only Miss Shani had a similar mindset. I'm just a more likable... <sighs> he won't last long if we leave him here. Let's take him with us. We'll work out our next step after we return to Aru Village.
We're back! You must be tired. What's the situation? Hmm? Who's this? Unfortunately, somebody who's too young to take on the role of Isak's grandfather. So, at one point in time... Yep, pretty much! Their plan must have been implemented at some point before we arrived at Aru Village, yet... Hmm. We may have a mole if one of us could be secretly... Re Looks like none of you have realized, but Sino. Wait, what's that supposed to mean? Choose your next... It is simply a lot. So what you're saying... Interesting. And here I... I know. You have a point. But I realized something as we were returning from the hospital. Sino is... What are you trying to say? Do you still remember... <sighs> as a matra, you are no doubt privy to certain kinds of information. Simply put, if you want to rape... The academia... It's not that simple. The Academia has eyes all over Sumeru, but they have every so often. I remember seeing the- You're saying that the Academia- But what's the point in do- The Akasha is capable- <sighs> The Akasha's- It predicted my- The Academia- So that's how- Tenacity of- Sino, don't take it- <sighs> They escaped because of me- Don't blame yourself. It's not like any of us would have known. an idea if they predicted my movements then I might be able to guess where they went whoa you bounced back fast there is always an opportunity for safety after danger passes oh so that's how it is Paimon gets it now if the academia is trying to avoid They'll want to proceed in the direction opposite of where I'm going. I must go. There's also something I want to investigate. Let's go, guys! After him! Please, wait! I want to go to... Hmm. I want to find Grim... Everyone, I leave him in your hands. Yes. After leaving the village, we should head straight toward the desert. I know the desert like the back of my hand. Is that because you play here a lot? Yep. One time, Grandpa almost got lost in the desert. But I was the one who brought him back. There's something here. What's this? It's buried in the sand. Ugh. And Paimon thought running around everywhere was already enough work. Okay, okay. So, we have to dig it out? Whatever's down there, it looks like it's buried really deep. These are likely fragments of an academia-developed device, something akin to a headset. Looks like there were more than one village keeper. They must have been escorted this way because there are device fragments scattered around here. Let's split up and search the area. 
chances are that we'll find other things nearby. Is this what we're searching for? It looks kind of scary. This is definitely a... How did it end up buried in the sand? They must have been attacked. Wait, what? Grandpa, I hope you're okay. Don't worry, your grandpa's gonna be... Razak didn't display any signs of starvation or... We should be able to catch up. One more thing. I believe the attack must have happened prior to the sandstorm. Let's keep going. They can't have gone far. Sand tiring too? Ugh, of course it is. Voices over there. Hmm. It sounds like an argument. Whoa, you have really good ears. Don't get any closer. They'll notice us. Dia's talking with the Aramites? Hm. Very interesting. Let's listen in. If you had informed me sooner, there'd be plenty- You're one of us. We would never lie. Scholars. You don't know as much as I- <laughs> I knew it. That's a- Dia? Why would you- Dia! Hey! What are you doing? Huh? Didn't you say- You'd help me find Grandpa? What? <laughs> Where? Uh, this complicates. You've betrayed Aru Village. So, this is the dear you'd be. I'm not the type that's. E Wait, what's going on, dear? Whose side are you on here? Shut it, Paimon. It doesn't matter. Whichever side you pick, nothing could deter us from the Grand... Face the facts, Raman. It's not gonna happen. You should understand... I'm a desert dweller and a proud follower of the Scarlet King. Whether I live by the edge of the sword or in peaceful comfort, my soul will all... It's not too late yet. The village keep... You don't understand, my dear lady. Even if it'll expose you to the Academia? Even if they end up disbanding the Aramites? Yes. We've waited a long time for this day to come. What these scholars in our- <sighs> Ridiculous. If you still don't believe me, then try asking these two men. They're also against the academia, but neither of them are as arrogant as you are. <laughs> they look more like pawns of the academia to me. Why would I listen to anything the people of filthy traitors? <sighs> it's impossible to- Perhaps we should. Do you really believe that by kidnapping the scholars, you'll be able to negotiate with the academia? These people have no value as bargaining chips. These scholars were exiled from the academia. I, on the other hand... Wait, you can't be serious. So, you want to... Precisely. Well, that would be bad. However, <laughs> I'm not trying to persuade you. Are the scrub? Not all desert dwell. <laughs> you academia scum! Every last one of you is nothing but a hypocrite, just like everyone else on the ad. Not so fast. I'll hate them. Do you stand by everything you just said? <laughs> I never make empty pro- You know you're making a dangerous decision. I do. Good. Raman, hear me out. These people are my friends. Maybe you can't take the followers of the- <sighs> We've known each other for years. Of course I do. In that case, I'm willing to vouch for their- <clears throat> Come on, Raman, don't- huh. But what if you refuse to oblige? What should I do then? No one's a fool here, Dia. We're mercs. You're not wrong, but this is different. I promised my... Uh, let's do it right here, then. Give me your right arm as proof of your resolve. Uh. Don't listen to him. He's not even trying to negotiate. He just wants to make things more difficult. 
That's fine. Are you crazy? We came here to save lives. One arm for that many people is still a pretty good deal, if you ask me. Rama- Sure. Go ahead and cut off her right arm. No! Dia! What are you gonna do? Think of something! You don't have to go- That's not for you to- Do it! Stop! What's wrong? Flame Mane, you and I are both desert folk. Cutting off your arm is no different than cutting off my own fingers. Where's the sense in cutting my own kin to pieces? <laughs> You've shown me that you're serious. Go on now, take... I was really counting. Yeah. That what? Mm, then I just have to hold my claymore with my left arm. <laughs> okay. Don't ever make a promise like that again. I can deal if it came down to it. I don't doubt it, Sino. Even if we got rid of. <sighs> I'm sorry, Dia. I should have stayed put. It's okay. I promised you I'd help find. Whatever it takes. <laughs> you just. Huh? Are you serious? The Eremites once... Why does it feel like he's using his praise for me as an excuse to brag about himself? Okay, let's... According to today's forest patrol route. Looks like we have everyone here. Isak, are you- I'll watch from a safe distance. Okay. Dia, wait. What's the matter? I heard that you were- Uh-oh. Is it because... 
because Paimon overslept by five minutes and helped... Is everything ready? Absolutely. You brought fewer people. Bring them out. Grandpa, why is there only... Raman, I've always thought of you as a... It's a one for... Well, let me put it this way. Agreeing... Uh-uh. <sighs> you stay right there! <laughs> shaking. Wait a second. It's a earthquake! This day's going just <laughs> The sand dune. I saw an energy field. It glowed green with Tentro. <laughs> just like you said. The Tentro are. Grandpa? Hey, look. Did there used to be. It seems that when the sand. The symbols on. It could have been an underground palace. Oh, a miracle. Praise. What's he doing? They must have fallen to... Uh, most of them seem in... <laughs> Mind your head. No, no, this is... Uh, he's... As it happens. What are you doing? Don't you think it's curious? Two major day... Paimon thought you... Indeed. New discoveries. Raman, what are you gonna do? I'll just let them lay... It's full of life here. This defies comprehension. Yeah! And there's so many plants. It's so- Sir Rama. What? Huh? <laughs> Are you mocking? Interpret it however you want. But there's something I'd like to draw your attention to. <laughs> Whatever you say. There's nothing to be- It does seem-
Blade embraces its duty. Oh, now that's a sight to see. The Scarlet King's splendor surrounds us. There's so much vegetation here. It's 
different than what I expected. Sure are a lot of plants for a desert. <laughs> That's what I call divine providence of the Scarlet King. Wait. What's that? A load of flowers. And it looks like there's something among... Oh, these are Scarlet King runes. They left something behind. Hmm. What does it say? Here lies his wisdom is... You can read? Of course. There's still something the scent of luck. Hmm. Is this it? Analyzing. Hmm. There seems to be a excellent. There's a div isn't shout. Yes. You'll understand after watching it. Civilization is born of knowledge. But so, too, can knowledge be its demise. A disaster caught us unaware. It was knowledge that did not belong to this world. The Scarlet King brought this forbidden knowledge into our world, and it quickly spread like a plague. People's minds were filled with crazed whispers. Dark gray scales spread across their bodies. Even the land was stripped of its vigor. Only a desperate, deathly silence remained. Were it not for greater Lord Ruka Devata from the forests, the damage would have been irreversible. She summoned the priests to build temples and infused into them the divine power of life. The disaster was miraculously tempered and the embers of our civilization were preserved in Aru village. Alas, the miracle could not last. As long as forbidden knowledge continued to exist, it would forever blight this world. In the end, the proud king of the desert, my eternal lord, chose to sacrifice himself. I have spent my whole life since guarding one of these many temples. But now, my duty is coming to an end. As I close my eyes for the final time, the sight of that noble deity will appear in my vision once more. In helping the Scarlet King to eradicate forbidden knowledge, she exhausted her strength, and her form became that of a small child. How strange. Now that I think of her, I no longer have any fear of death, for I sense that the spirit of life will abide with me during my eternal sleep. Children of the desert, cling no longer to past grievances, but hold tight to the memory of this act of benevolence. What was that? The priest's memories. No. No, impossible. Greater Lord Rukadevata. So the former Dendro Archon and the Scarlet King were never enemies at all. This doesn't make any sense. The Dendro Archon's followers, they're clearly... Was that the former Dendro Archon? He became so tiny in the end. You might be distrust. You've just witnessed... I've 
Never the surviving followers of the Scarlet King all gathered. The Scarlet King's jet we saw her as nothing more than a traitor. You were blinded by your prejudice. <laughs> How could I ever be? Ramon, give it a rest. You're Deep my Aramites. Hey. How you doing? Uh, I should probably go. What's your next move gonna be? Oh, but please. It's not gonna be. Well, I guess that's for me to do. When would be a good time? Tomorrow. And I'll. You seem to finally understand. Yes. That must have been rough. But he. <sighs> Ramon's no fool. It's too bad he was held back by his belief. The outcome. We should get going too. Stop you. Useless. Raman? Everything's been arranged. I guess all I can... Ah, yeah, don't mention. But we... Where are the purpose? I'll bring you to them. So these are the people who kidnapped the village keepers. Oh no, it's the... There's no need to... We've been all over the... That's right. General Mahamatra? No, no. Whoa. The moment you should have known. Wait, we were no, not so I could. Please have start talk. So your superior Uh they don't play. They extract divine I I, I... Well, you better stop. You don't want to make things any more difficult for yourself, do ya? Be my guest. you know there's no use hiding it now yes you're right the academia is working on an important and potentially world change it may seem the withering of ermin soul has been getting worse recently the sages have tried everything they could think of but nothing's worked i'm always hearing them say things like continue and then the doctor was previously expelled from the academia at first the sages looked down at him in disdain but he asked them this is what the first the Academia's after that, with the doctor's help, and the Akat next, it adds up. But how do you determine whether the no- Call it an educated guess? The nobody can explain the cause of this phenomenon. Uh, sure, if it's knowledge, no- Hmm. 
You must have noticed by now. It is as if they are cursed with a desire. Some organ is this. Is then what does less? Is she not a true? From the beginning, when the academia they found that at the not to mention slowly but surely. So. All right, let's try. Raman. Get sure. The village keepers you found. Uh, hey, say something. Stop spacing out. Come on, is the or I oh, but do you have any plans, traveler? Gods above, you're not talking about work. Hmm. So you were. this firsthand it's still what a whirlwind of a store it seems like they're mm. still it's time to make indeed so crush the sages and rescue our god well the next time we get yep It'll... <laughs> 